Welcome back to Tiny Town. I hope you guys have activated big brain mode because I want your best comments. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and build some weird things today. Oh yeah, that's right. Remember this weird thing from the last video? I got over a thousand comments from people saying Miss Lemons. That's who it is. It is exactly Miss Lemons. I'm just gonna pull out her eyeballs, toss them into the roof. They just exploded. <laughs> she has explodey eyeballs. Okay, take off the glasses and just go on a big delete fest. There we go. Her lips were left. That was kind of weird. All right, let's go ahead and start building the next one. This video game character isn't really... I, I, actually, I'm not going to give too much away. I think this one's going to be a pretty easy one for you guys. So I'm going to try and make it a bit abstract so that it's a bit harder to guess. Okay, here we go. We're going to start with a human. Oh, I'm going to start with this guy. Just ignore his hat. Okay, I'm just kind of going with the red bit to start with. And I'm going to crumple his legs into his own body there, just like this. Like he's trying to squat down a mine shaft or something. That's kind of a weird thing to do. Okay, let's put his legs like this. There we go. He's got broken kneecaps. Okay, now this part, I'm actually just going to go like this with his head. All right. Like I said, this one's going to be mega abstract. You guys are going to have to guess who this guy is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now we need to get some other bits. Uh, let's get some parts. Oh, I went past it. No, wait, where is it? Aha! Here it is! I need this, okay? We've got one crab arm coming out the side here like this. Is the crab arm a bit of a, like, a clue? Maybe it is! Let's go ahead and put those there. Oh yeah, we got the crab guy. Okay, now we need to get... Oh, uh, let's go with these. I'm gonna see if I can use these to kind of build what I'm going for. <laughs> oh yeah, this is good. This is like the character, but if he was put in like a blender and just all mashed up together, you know what I mean? This is what the dude is. Okay, now I need some eyeballs. I'm just gonna put some eyeballs. There we go. Oh man, this guy is like some kind of weird horror dude. It's looking pretty good though. I mean, if you knew what I was building, you'd be like, oh man, Finn, that guy is an absolute masterpiece. Not me, this is the masterpiece. I'm the artist. Okay, and I'm gonna give him some eyebrows. But these eyebrows are just made out of arms. There we go, just monster arm. Let's put him up here like this. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> Look at this dude. He looks like he's doing a dance or like he's part gorilla. Cowboy Gorilla Crab Man. That's who he is. Oh, God. Oh, God. I've lifted up the entire island again. I really need to stop doing that. Imagine if Donkey Kong was also a crab. Yeah, you guys think about that for a little while. A little bit of food for thought. All right. That's my character. I want you guys to guess who he is. What maybe game or television show he's from. Bit of a clue. You guys can work it out. All right, let's head back over to the city. We've got to go over this way. We've got to build some stuff. The dude we built on the last video, the food guy, was this dude right here. He is, of course, a hot dog ninja. But I got a comment from someone called Rumble who said, why don't you make him called Sausage Samurai? And that is just, mwah. I'm doing the, you know, the kissy th thing expression. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's such a good name. Sausage Samurai. I like this guy. I could just imagine on the sword, he would have like a sausage and he'd be barbecuing it or something like that. That'd be incredible. Although then again, that would mean he actually is a cannibal because he eats himself. That's or eats, eats his species. We also built this portal on the last video. It was really hard to find the comments about the portal in amongst all the Miss Lemons comments. There were just too many, okay? I really struggled. But if you got ideas on what to stick coming out of the portal, let me know in the comments. Or if you see someone that has a, an idea that's similar to yours, just go ahead and maybe, you know, tick the comment, give it a thumbs up. That way we know that, uh, well, it's easier to find. Also, I got a few suggestions from people to uh, put someone in the fountain here stealing some coins. So let's do that. I'm sure we can find someone. There's probably even a snorkel person. We've got some... A uh, stunt man. This guy is called Daredevil. Okay, this guy is not swimming. Daredevil. He is, I don't know, he's gonna do some stunts or something. Let's just get him up there like that. He's gonna do a stunt. Maybe you've got an idea for some crazy stunts he can do. Maybe he breaks his leg or something on the pavement. Who knows? Oh yeah, yeah, here we go. Here we go. We've got a person. Hang on, let's go for this person. A little bit of diversity. All right, <laughs> let's get this guy to look like he's swimming. Okay, nice. And he's swimming for coins, except he can't swim very well. So let's actually not make him look like he's swimming. And more like he's drowning 
or not drowning because he's got scuba gear on, but he's really scared. Okay, and he's like this. He's like, Ugh! actually, let's make him tiny and maybe put him up here like this. Wait, that doesn't work. All right, there we go. There we go. This guy's struggling in the fountain and he was stealing coins. So let's make some coins. You should never steal money out of a fountain. Okay, there's better places to steal money. Fountains just don't, don't have a lot of money in them. <laughs> All right, let's go with this. All right, there we go. There's that guy's money. Definitely still in money, not a thief, but like a scuba ninja thief assassin guy. That's who he is. But then we've got a pig, all right? And the pig is where the money has come from. He's actually up here and he's pooping the money into the fountain because of course everyone knows pigs are full of money. There we go, just pooping chunks of money out there. Basically just a stream of coins coming out of the pig's bum into the fountain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good job, pig. Yeah, let's give the pig a hat. Because the pig kind of reminds me of the pig from uh, Goat Simulator. So let's go ahead and give him a hat. Maybe he's got the pirate hat that makes the giant tentacles come out of the ground. You know what I mean? The kraken thing. I like that thing. It's good. Okay, there we go. Pig C. Guy picking up pig poop. I mean, coin. All right, it's time to start building our next food guy. Now, this one is actually kind of... This one's a bit different. It's not actually food. It contains food. We're going with a drink guy, a drink machine thing, okay? Also, you might have noticed, I've added some mountains to the background. Kind of a nice backdrop, and it makes it feel like the world is a little bit more real. <laughs> okay, not real. It just looks better, all right? Let me know what you think in the comments. Let's get this drink dude, though. This is basically gonna be like a drink machine that has come to life, and it shoots actual, like, its own children, okay? You know what I mean? Like, it it actually launches tiny drinks that are alive as well. I know, I'm a genius. Okay, let's go. This thing needs a body. Let's go with a clown body. I think a clown one's pretty good because I like how colorful he is. <laughs> All right, let's put his arms out here like this, right? Like he's just got his arms out and he's full on just launching these tiny drink children things. Okay, let's go like that. <laughs> That is good. <laughs> yeah, I like this. I like where this is going a lot. Okay, maybe he's got sunglasses on. Does he have sunglasses? Uh, nah, I don't like the sunglasses that much. Okay, he's got to have eyes, though. So let's get some eyes. Uh, are they down here like this? Where are we going to put these eyes? We don't need three eyes. Okay, do they look good there? Do they look good there? Nope. What about on the side of him, like a fish? Nah. <laughs> Okay, hang on. Maybe we make him super big and we put him sort of on the edge. Hey, that doesn't look too bad. Okay, then we give him some eyebrows. Make him like angry, right? Oh yeah. Yeah, this guy is awesome. Does he have a nose? Uh, a nose made of like an eggplant? Nah. Oh no, he's a clown. He's gotta have a clown nose. Okay, where's a red sphere? Why do clowns have red noses? I don't get it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This works. Oh, that's good. <laughs> I wish I could just do that. Oh my god. That is the best. I love that. I love that a lot. Except I wanted to have the drinks shooting out of there. Out of his mouth. And if I do that, it just I can't do that. It just doesn't work. Unless the drinks shoot out of his armpit. Maybe that would work. Mm. Or they can they can be fired out of his chin. And we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> that looks better. That looks a thousand times better. All right, let's get some drinks. Okay, there's a drink. There's another one. Are these the regular sodas? Okay, let's zoom in so we can see what's going on. Okay, get these cans. These things are being launched out of his chin. Or it's, it's kind of... Is it his chin? I mean, is your chin between your legs? No, it's not. Your, your pelvis is, okay? <laughs> God. Okay, hopefully this doesn't end up being one of those videos I regret. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Things are going so well. There we go. Alrighty, nice. Just cans flying out of there. This is great. Oh, look at this guy. He's got such character. Okay, gotta give these guys some little eyes. Oh, yeah. They got like little cartoon eyes. Look at them. They're so cute. They kind of look a little bit like, I don't know, soda can version of a cute little pug dog or something. Yeah, sody. Oh my god. I just realized I made one that kind of looks a little bit like train eater. He's got too many eyeballs. All right, there we go. Oh, so good. All right. Yep. I reckon this guy we have nailed. He was so good. Let me know in the comments if you've got a name for this guy. Some, he's a drink machine. He shoots sodas out of this region. Um, I don't know. Oh, look at this. And if you go... He, oh, oh my god. I can't decide. Angry or like sad or happy, happy evil. You know what I mean? Like, I can't tell. I don't know which one looks better. They both look really good. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay, let's head back over to our Ban Ban scene. 
which is slowly evolving. In the last video, we made Nibbler. This guy is up here. Now, Nibbler is indeed evil, right? And I got a comment from someone was saying, I'll make Zolfius. Here he is right here. I've got this guy already in our Ban Ban scene. He's hanging out, looking pretty awesome. Doing exactly what, I, what he does, which is nothing. He just stands there. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and add my newest dude. We are adding in Coach Pickles. A few people have asked me to put in Coach Pickles before. So that's what we're going to do. Let's get him in there. And if you guys have ideas of who you want to see me build next in the next Tiny Town video, maybe it's that kangaroo guy. I don't know his name. I don't think anyone knows his name yet. Maybe we'll do that. It's like a fairy looking kangaroo thing, which I'm super happy about because come on, Australia, kangaroo, that's incredible. All right, there we go. These two are just watching what's unfolding. Now we've got Ban Ban over here. I'm just going to rip this guy apart and put him just over this way. So that we've got space to put our newest dude. All right, <laughs> take his eyeballs off. All right, put his hats over there. Put him in a safe space right there on top of the eyes. Oh, that's good. Maybe we could just build him backwards or like build his arms out of his head like we've made a uh, Captain Fiddles version. There we go. Ban Ban Fiddles. Yeah, that works. And I don't know what these are. They go on his knees. No, they don't. They go there. <laughs> <laughs> all right, nice. Okay, let's get all these pieces I've made. Uh, I think that's all of them. Now, this guy is quite big. I've got to remember how to piece this dude together. I sort of want to put him, uh, like his legs over here. Let's just move this trap door over this way a little bit. All right, yeah, that's cool. And then we'll get his foot like this. And we've got to make sure this one's the same size. We can't have him being all bodgy and wonky. All right, all right. He sort of stood on the edge of the building like this. Nice. I can't remember how I made this guy. All right, hang on a sec. All right, there we go. There's his head. And he's sort of looking down like this a little bit. Make the head a bit bigger. Is that the right size? Because I'm changing the proportions a little bit, I've got to make sure that I get all the proportions the same. So this dude actually has some arms. He's got like arms that sort of stick out of his body like this. It's really cool because he's sort of built like an elephant, but also built like a little bit like Nibbler at the same time because he's got this cool sort of arm sort of U-shape thing going on. You know what I mean? Like he walks on his arms. Okay, we'll get the other arm as well. Nice. And the thing I like about this guy is that he's a good guy. Coach Pickles is a really nice dude. He helps out everybody. He's got a big long trunk like that. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Nice. Maybe we'll put the trunk a little bit there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. All right. Get his ears on there. And then we can put Ban Ban back together as well. Oh, uh, that ear is way too big. Actually, the ears go this way. All right. There we go. I mean, these characters sort of show how awesome Google Blocks is. You can make some really amazing stuff in it. Okay, I'm going to put Ban Ban under this guy because he's being crushed. That's right. Like I said, Coach Pickles is actually a good character and he's managed to stop Ban Ban by crushing him with his foot. Yeah, nice. Just pinned him to the ground under the giant elephant foot. If only I could stop him from smiling because at the moment it looks like he's enjoying it. <laughs> All right, there we go. The party hats have sort of fallen off a bit, I guess. Nice. Yeah, take that. Get crushed, bro. Okay. Oh, he's missing eyes. <laughs> Oops. There we go. All right. Let's get him looking down like this. So he's sort of looking down at Ban Ban, who is crushing. How's that? Yeah. Awesome. Look at this guy. I like Coach Pickles. <laughs> <laughs> he looks incredible. All right, guys. Let me know in the comments who you want to see me build next. And thank you very much for watching this video. Catch you guys next time.